What's up, what's up? We're back again, doing a little finger painting, as you can tell. We got that right there on there, and we're just kind of finessing it in there, I guess you could say. Just kind of getting it in the little cracks and crevices. Trying to make it uniform looking. Let me get up on this side. <clears throat> get a little bit on the old glove there. Kind of feel that void in, making it smooth looking, I guess you'd say. Doop doo. Getting that pookie face. Debbie Will. Better than uh, Bondo. Or at least I say it is. Cheaper too. You get it at the dollar store. <laughs> I'm going to put a little bit up here. Around it out a little bit, make it look all nice. And then after that, we'll let it dry and do a little sanding on it. And hopefully, by this weekend, we'll be ready to paint. And for y'all, y'all, y'all getting ready for uh, Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to y'all. If y'all have children. Do a little bit more on there. Oh, what I was going to show y'all, I didn't show on my last video. Here's my mountain board right here. That is one project that I've been waiting and wanting to get on for a long time. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need one of the helmets. And possibly some bubble wrap. Bubble wrap may help. But... We're going to go ahead and use up the rest of this stuff right here and kind of get it looking a little better. A little more uniformy. And I'll show you all the paint that we're going to be using. He wanted it the colors of uh, the Texas Longhorns. So, let me get this glove off real quick. Ah. And then, I'll show y'all the paint that we will be using. This is it right here. It's a nice little burnt orange metallic. It should look pretty nice on it. We're also going to paint the forks black. Let's see what else did we say we were painting black? I think that was it. I think that was the the forks only. But in the meantime, this is what's going on with the little drifter. Hopefully, we'll have it out pretty soon. Until then, I will get back to y'all. Peace. 